has everything ups and downs with everything, obviously. Um, some days it's a good day, some days it's a bad day. Depending on how the wife is, if she's in that kind of a mood. She, as you know, she suffers with Parkinson's. And they have these different moves each day. Never, never one day the same. Um, just make a breakfast in the morning. Make sure I do all the, I do all the cooking more or less. All the shopping. She does go out with her daughter now and again. But I look after her. I have my daughter come in. If she comes in on a Monday, she takes the wife out somewhere shopping. Uh, I have my grandson, he comes round on a Wednesday and he stops with his grandma. Wednesdays and Sundays, he comes down for three hours, two or three hours a day. You know, when I go out, I could, so I can go out on a Sunday. I, like, I go fishing on a Sunday. So the grandson comes down, and sits, 26 year old, comes and sits with her grandma. What they talk about, I don't know. Well, it helps me so I can go out, and I can go out in peace. There's, there's somebody there looking after my wife. It gives me a relaxation, I can relax more. Mm. And that's about it, yeah, that's it. <clears throat> I know if I, I, like, when I do a lot of fishing, or, or fishing on a Sunday, I know for a fact that if I go from fishing, I've got family coming in to look after her. And that's, that's, that's the beauty of it. And I can give them something in place of that. Well, I won't have anybody except my family. Uh, and, you know, so you someone I can trust with Margaret. And that's the main thing. Oh, it makes me happy, yeah. It makes me do a lot better because I can know I can go out and relax. I don't know, she's been properly looked after. And they do look after her properly. Because I've asked her, I said, oh, how are you going on today? Oh, we're all right today. Uh, you know, the her to the toilet, they fetch her back from the toilet. Even lads are doing it, so, you know. It's helped Margaret a lot, and it's helped me a lot. In that sense, yes, yeah. Whereas I wouldn't be able to continue my sport, I wouldn't be able to continue doing, going out to my clubs. Whereas it, all this has helped. I never did any out. I never got no any help. We'd always be at Logger Ends. I'd be in that house. I don't know. I never been ever. I couldn't tell you about that because that's what would happen, I suppose. Mm. If I were in with Margaret on her own and nobody to help her, I don't know what I'd do. Probably just pack my bags and go. That's how I'd put it because I couldn't, couldn't cope on the wrong with me. Couldn't cope with it. Yeah, without help, you know, you, you wouldn't. I couldn't cope, I wouldn't be able to cope. I just, that would be it. <laughs>